Fire says crews were dispatched to Sugarloaf Drive for reports of a person in a home with a gunshot wound. When they got there, they learned it was the officer. Now we're going to take you to Vanderbilt University Medical Center where the officer is being treated. But we start with News 4's Rebecca Cardness live at the scene in South Nashville. Rebecca, what can you tell us? Hey, Marius, we've spoken to a couple neighbors here who report hearing several gunshots. One neighbor I spoke to said she heard two rounds of several gunshots. And I want to give you context for where this is all going on. We're on the corner of Sugar Plum and Sunnywood Drive here in South Nashville. But if you follow this line of cop cars, and by the way, there are at least a dozen police cars out here right now. Right where they end there, there's another intersection. So the situation that we're talking about right now is around the corner there. Right now, I can tell you over the last 15 minutes or so, we've been able to hear officers on a megaphone um, calling for someone. It's unclear exactly what they're saying. We're not close enough to make it out, but I can tell you that they are calling for someone over a megaphone. There's clearly still an active situation going on here. SWAT officers have begun arriving here on the scene. And as you said here, we have it confirmed that a police officer, a Metro Nashville police officer was shot and transferred from the scene here. As far as other details as to what led up to this shooting um, and the circumstances surrounding it, we're still working on that information. In fact, we just talked to an officer on the scene who says a media staging area is being set up here on the other side of this crime scene. We're expecting to hear from a commander or some sort of spokesperson from the Metro Nashville Police Department here soon. So we'll keep you updated with whatever we learn next. Marius and Tracy. All right, certainly alarming. Rebecca Cardenas, thank you. Want to bring in News Force Cameron Taylor from Vanderbilt University Medical Center. Cameron, you were actually there when that ambulance arrived. That's right, Tracy. This is where the officer was taken, Vanderbilt's emergency room, and several police officers are still here tonight. We were here as an ambulance and several patrol cruisers rushed to the emergency room. Now, tonight we are working to find out the condition of the officer. As soon as we get any updates on the officer's condition, we will make sure to pass them along to you right here on News 4. We'll send it back to you, Tracy. Cameron, thank you so much. I'll take it from here. Here's what we know so far. An officer is being treated at Vanderbilt University Medical Center after being shot at an incident that happened in Antioch. That's right. Sugarloaf Drive, if you're familiar with that area. Rebecca was just there at the scene telling us that they heard officers with a megaphone out there, that there are multiple, at least a dozen police cars out there at that scene. It is still very active, so it's not known if perhaps the suspect is still out there and they're trying to talk to him and negotiate with him, but SWAT teams have arrived. And a lot going on. Continue to follow Follow us. We'll have the very latest news right here on air and the very latest breaking information on the News 4 app. We now return to regular programming. Get more updates at WSMV.com and on the WSMV app.